Good morning dear students let us take a look at a question from JE advanced 2020 this question is from the rotation chapter so let us first analyze the question a small roller of diameter 20 cm has an axle of diameter 10 cm so you can see here that this is a roller and its diameter its diameter i've given here is 20 cm and this roller has an axle and the diameter of this is 10 cm it is on a horizontal floor and a meter scale is positioned horizontally on its axle with one edge of the scale on top of the axle so this roller here is on a horizontal floor and there is a meter scale which is placed on this just above the axle the scale is now pushed slowly on the axle so that it moves without slipping on the axle and the roller starts rolling without slipping this scale here is pushed such that the scale rolls on this axle and this roller rolls on the ground without slipping so let us have a look at the schematic can see that this scale is rolling on the axle and it is not slipping and this roller is also rolling on the ground and it is also not slipping after the roller has moved 50 cm the position of the scale will look like he is saying that if this roller has moved by 50 cm then the position of the scale will look like he has given some diagrams in the option and we need to choose the correct option so i'll just share the diagrams here so in the options you can see here that this end of the scale is x equal to 0 cm and the right end of the scale is x equal to 100 cm so i have marked it here this is 0 25 50 75 and 100 let us consider two points on this body one is at the center of the body and the other is at the point where the scale rests on the axle it is given the diameter of this uh, roller is 20 cm so from here to here it is 10 cm and the diameter of this axle is given as 10 cm so from here to here it is 5 cm so this is 5 cm 10 cm so this whole length is 15 cm if the angular velocity of this roller is omega we can say that the velocity of this point is r into omega so which is 10 into omega and the velocity of this point is 15 into omega in the question he has given that the roller moves by 50 cm which means this point the center point has moved by 50 cm so we can write if body rolls for time t then this point if it has moved by 50 cm the velocity of this point into time so 10 omega into t equals to 50 cm we can cancel out this 10 and 50 and we can write omega t equals to 5 radians now in the question what is asked is how much has this point moved relative to this point see if this point has moved relative to this point by 50 cm then this would be the correct option if this point has moved relative to this point by 25 cm then this would be the correct option so we just need to find out how much this point on the meter scale has moved relative to the center of the roller so the movement of 100 mark of meter scale relative to the roller center so the moment of this 100 mark relative to the roller center is the relative velocity into time so this velocity is 10 omega this velocity is 15 omega relatively how much this has moved is 15 omega minus 10 omega into t which is nothing but 5 omega into t omega into t we have the value here which is 5 radians we just put here 5 and we get 25 cm so relative to the center this 100 mark has moved by 50 cm in the option a in option b this 100 mark has moved by 25 cm this is 100 and this is 
this is 25 centimeter so the b is the correct option so we can say b is the correct option to this question let us have a look at the schematic so you can observe here relative to center this point has moved by 25 centimeters